Right then, you lot, hello, welcome to something a little bit different on this channel. Now, I know I've been away, it's a new year, it's a new me, and I thought it should be a new game. So, here we are with Car Mechanic Simulator 2018. I know it's now 2019, but obviously they haven't got the um, Car Mechanic Simulator 2019. So, yeah, this is what we're going to do on the channel for a while. I'm quite into this game at the minute, as you guys know. I am a big car guy, so things like this do entertain me quite well. And, yeah, so... Let's have a look around. This is my garage. This is mine. I bought it apparently. And this is mine to now customize. What we can do is basically we order in, we have orders here and they come up with cars. Uh, they say we've got a problem, we've got to fix those problems, and they come up with a description of things that happen and we have to deal with those. But we also have a wheel balancer, we have a tire changer to do with tires, we have a toolbox where we can actually upgrade. Our workshop, as you can see, we can make a 50% faster part examination. We can then go up to getting ourselves a test path and a workbench and things like that. This, this game is really an expandable game since 2017. That game was a bit boring and like you can see all the updates in like all of the um, equipment on the walls and things like that. It's actually a really, really good game. So what we have here is like nothing you can really play with here because obviously once you expand, this wall will go back and it'll become the table. So this stuff is pretty much irrelevant at the moment. As we come here, we have our phone. Now, if you go on the phone, it's the exact same as the orders, which you can get up on the screen here. Now, I just find it easier to go through that screen, but if you want to be so realistic, there's your phone. Uh, you can also come along here to your computer. And this is, will be the computer where you'll be able to buy all your new parts. We'll go to your main shop. If it'll load. Here we are. Oh, God, I don't want to buy an air filter, but you can, you can go your gearbox. You can go get all the little essential things that you're going to need for a car. And you can even... Uh, type and search. Like if I put a rubber, whoops, uh, rubber bushing, then there you go. It'll come up with the things that you need. So, without further ado, I think you guys grasp the concept of this game. Engine stands and oil drainer will be used eventually once we level up and things like that. But for now, let's get into our first order, which will be the Mayan M3, which surprisingly looks like a Audi S3 to me. But yeah, here we are. It's yeah, it's it's an Audi. It's just an Audi. look look at that. <laughs> look at the uh, the what do you want to call it? The badge on it. It's like the Audi's meant to be four circles. So that was three because they want to have copyright. Um, I do have the DLCs in this. So we have like Paganis and things like that will come here eventually. But yeah, for now, let's check out the car status. So we're gonna need a brake caliper, a brake disc, and a brake caliper. So first thing I always do is move the car onto the lift because obviously we're, we're going to need to jack the car up so let's get these things underneath lift the bad boy up right let me check what do we need we need two brick colors and a disc so let's go over here and buy those things hopefully we'll have enough for it so let's go we need a two calipers i believe and a disc where's the disc there it is so let's buy that as well and hopefully this will be an easy job on the front of the car because I don't want to be doing anything that I don't need to be doing so let's take this wheel off as you can see you even take the wheels off which I think is quite cool Jesus this takes a long time to get those wheels off I'm hoping yes it is you can see how bad the caliper's got and you come around the back here and you've got the two bolts you've got to take off here uh, we'll take this off and we'll take that off and hopefully in our infantry we'll find something that's not good as you can see here is the brad brake caliper which i don't want to sell at the minute oh which i just did by accident whoops and i believe now if we go into car mount the mode we can have our new ventilated or the same one actually sorry disc have the pads on and then hopefully we'll be able to put the new one of the new should i say calipers on there you go, we can tighten it back up again, and we should be able to put the wheel back on, there we go, bish bash bosh, I like ramen on toast, so let's put this bad boy back on, and we'll come around and we'll do the second side, ooh, I just figured out we can bend down, I never realised this feature, huh. I'm hoping, can I have a look? Caliper is good, in my opinion. This is just like a cheating way. If you can have a look, see how the calipers are. That's 
sound. It's this one over here, you can see it already. So what we're going to do is we're going to take this off. Obviously as time goes on, uh, you'll be able to get features from the toolbox, which will make like taking these wheel nuts off a lot quicker and things. Oh yeah, there we go. You can tell already, that's what I like about the detail in this game. You can tell when things need replacing. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to take the brake pads off, but we're then going to take the, the brake disc, because you only have ventilator at the front, because those are the ones that create more heat. So you learn things. This is science. Basically science. So we're going to then put a cylinder with it. Yes, we want to install that. And put that together like so. Put a rim on. Tighten her up. And we should actually be good to go. I believe I've done everything. Boom. So what we're going to do is go to check the status, check that everything is good. It was just brake problems. We worked on a main M3, which kicks out around 308 horsepower, which that's not too bad. Finish the order. And that is our first job done. As you can see, that's basically how the game's going to work. And then eventually, I don't believe we have anything we can upgrade at the minute. We don't have any skill points available, so we can't upgrade anything at the minute. But I say we do another job. Uh, we got, we just have to take this one because there's no other, <clears throat> no other jobs for us to take. Excuse me. So here we have a VW Golf, but what do they call it? They call it an MDN lot. Okay, so this is going to be a bit more of a tricky one than the brakes, but I think we're always up for a challenge. Let's move it on over to our workstation. Get up on the ramp because I can see it's, it wanted new wheels. So it's going to have to come off the, uh, it's going to have to be jacked up to be able to get these wheels off. So let's get these boys off. I don't know um, how many episodes of this I'm going to do, but hopefully we'll get a few in. Because I really do enjoy playing this game. Boom. Right, we'll go off to the other side. So I like the fact that how the animation shows that the wheel's not even on, which I think is quite cool. It shows they've gone to a lot of detail in this game, for once, in a game. Right, so let's go here. Take this bad boy off. Boom. Right, so what else was on the list of things? All the tires, a fuel filter and an air filter. Now, if you go in here, you should be able to find the air filter, which is in here. And you have these little tiny clips right here, which you take off. And which I find quite cool about this game is that it relates to real life. So there are generally clips like this that you need to take off. Then you have the air filter cover you got to take off in here. You'll find your air filter. You got to take that off. Let's have a quick look at the percentage of it. Oh, one percent. The thing was basically useless. Um. I don't think these... Oh, they do have a fuel filter, sorry, at the front. There's a fuel filter. Sweet. So, let's go on over to our computer of luxury. Because we do like this. We go over here, we're going to type in fuel... Fuel tour. Sorry if that was a bit loud on the keyboard. Um, by that, we'll buy an air filter as well. Uh, I think for now, we just want a basic air filter. And then uh, we got to go back and we got to go to the tyre shop. And we wanted standard tyre B. Um, did it matter about um, size? Uh, let me take a quick picture of that so we've got something for reference. Obviously you won't see that, but I've just taken a photo. Alright, so we're going to go back into the computer and we're going to have a standard tyre B. Um, what we've got is a 205... Uh, by 55. 205, 55, yep. And we're going to need four of these. It's going to cost a lot. $872, mad. Right, let's buy them. We've only got three and 3,100 pounds left. So, like I was saying before, about this, this machine over here. So what we're going to need to do is use this and separate the parts. Um, as you can see, it's just the tires that need changing. So what we want to do is we want to separate them from each other. They go on the wheel machine, and as you can see, it starts to move, which I think is quite cool. Shows a really cool animation of the game. 
and then we're going to take that. What we're going to do is then put it on here. Oh yeah, because it's not. Uh, that's a bit embarrassing because it's not even. We haven't even put the new tires on yet. But yeah, I think we got a lot of. If you watch other people play this game, you can see that their garage expands a lot, and that's what we'll be able to do at some point in the future, hopefully very very soon. Uh, but for now, we've got to work with our little garage. I quite like living around here. Like having my own little space to do the things I want to do, things like that. But yeah. While we're doing these ties, I hope you guys had a good new year. Hope everything is going well for you guys. I'm hopefully coming back with a lot more videos this year. Obviously, I know last year, towards the end, uh, was when things started to slack. But hopefully, I'm here. I'm ready to go. Especially with some car simulator. But for now, I think we'll call it mechanic simulator, something like that. But yeah, so let's install the new tyres onto the rim. As you can see, it's going down. Very cool. Very, very, very cool. But now what we can do is take that. We can then put it on the wheel balancer to be balanced. Like so. And then we can, at the same time... Oh, no, I don't want to separate. I don't want to separate on that install. We can do two things at the same time, which I think is quite cool. As you can see, that one's being balanced. Because uh, you don't want any juddering in the wheel. While well, that one's being... Take that. Install. I think at this rate, flipping it, we're going to be catching it up. And then we can take that. Balance of that. Bam, bomb, bing. Bob Junkle. Take that. Uh, install the last one. And then, all we got to do is just install everything on the car. The job should be done. Oh, that's not done yet take that I think we're now done with the time machine I think you should be done now take that all right get that balanced and while that's being balanced what we can do is come over to the car and fit up the wheels really have nice and new set of tires on them and it's pretty cool if, like if you guys drive or you're looking to drive and you want to learn how to do little things on your car then this sort of shows you how to do those things is that the last wheel no, one more. There we go, get that balanced. And yeah, while I was doing that, we can come over and put this wheel on. But yeah, it just gives you little life tips, I think, but I find this game quite entertaining. Like with all the different cars and all the different scenarios you can get in this game, which I think is quite cool. So hopefully you should be done soon. Come on, boy, come on. Come on, mate. Take that, boom. Right, then what we're gonna do is come along and, oh God mount the rim but yeah like I was saying before the toolbox you, that's where you can get skill points and they're like various skill points could give you like quicker uh, talking up things like that which I think is quite cool so eventually we'll be on top of that but for now we're, we're chilling we're chilling bang bang boom and then what was it a fuel filter and air filter we got to replace so mount the air filter in. Oh, look at that. Brand new. Nice and brand new. Put the air filter cover on. And then the. Oh, zoom in a bit. Oh, God. I don't want to, There we go. That's what I wanted. Uh, we then got to put the clips on. This is a bit more tricky to get your mouse on. But you can put the clips back on, which keeps the air filter box down. Because all the air goes into, obviously, the filter. And we don't want that to be flying off. And a load of stuff getting in. Boom, that's done. Put the fuel filter in. Easy to easy work, easy work. Close the bonnet. And that should be a job done. Oh wait, hang on. Change oil, drain. Oh, okay, that's easy enough. So what you want to do guys is just lift your car up. Or our golf, for example. And this is where our oil drain thing is gonna come in handy. So now that is done, we will move the equipment and we'll move it to lift A. And what you want to do is just use equipment and you'll start to see all of the oil come flooding down. That's it. That's literally all you want to use that for. We'll move that back on over and then we'll put the car back down because we're going to need it. Come on, back down. Open her up again. And then you want to find your little oil cap, which is here. And then just dunk your oil in. This is what I find is quite really, really cool how realistic this game is. And I love it. I love it. I know you guys, some of you guys probably won't enjoy like these types of games, but for me, I like playing it. I just don't want to overfill. Oh god! But yeah, I'm gonna play it. This is what I want to do. So I took one of my videos. This is what I'm gonna do now. 
Oh no, I don't no 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 normal mode. And bish bash bosh. Job is a good one. We now got 5k. Um can we upgrade anything at the minute? Nope. Uh, do we have any more orders? We do. Hmm. Do I want to do that now or should I wait for another episode? I think what I'm gonna do guys is leave that one for another episode. I think we'll take that. We'll take the job. Because we can always um we can always come and do it. Oh god, look at look at this. Jesus Christ. Uh, we've got ABS pump, module, disc, and caliper. That's pretty easy stuff, but we'll move on over to the ramp. And yeah, we'll come back to that as a later episode. So, guys, if you have enjoyed this first episode of Car Mechanic Simulator and you want to see more of this stuff, then why not hit that like button? Also, if you're new around here, that subscribe button to be notified when I next upload. And yeah, until again, guys, I'll see you guys later. But until then, peace. Peace.